Ever wondered why the Golden Gate Bridge was constructed in the first place? Imagine the beautiful city of San Francisco, separated from Marin County by the vast, imposing expanse of the Golden Gate Strait. This geographical barrier posed quite the challenge for travel between the two areas. Before the bridge was even an inkling of a concept, ferry services were the primary means of transportation across the strait. But as the population swelled and the demand for a more practical solution to travel needs increased, the limitations of the ferries became glaringly apparent. The idea of a bridge spanning the Golden Gate Strait was not new. It had been proposed as early as the late 19th century. But it wasn't until the early 20th century that the concept became more than just a whimsical dream. The bridge was seen as a practical and necessary solution to the growing transportation needs of the area. It was clear that a bridge was the answer to the growing transportation needs, but transforming this idea into reality was not going to be easy. With the need for a bridge established, the daunting task of its construction came next. The responsibility fell on the shoulders of Joseph Strauss, who served as the chief engineer. But this mammoth undertaking was not a one-man job. It was the collective efforts of different engineers that brought the Golden Gate Bridge to life. The journey, however, was not smooth sailing. The project faced initial opposition and legal hurdles, a rocky start for a venture of this scale. Yet, the team persevered, bolstered by support from the government, the automobile industry, and local communities, that saw the potential benefits of the bridge. The design of the bridge was a melting pot of innovation and creativity. Irving Morrow, the architect behind the iconic bridge towers, integrated artistry with engineering. Leon Moisef, a seasoned structural engineer, developed the overall structural design, balancing aesthetics with functionality. In 1923, the bridge was officially christened as the Golden Gate Bridge, a name that would go on to become synonymous with San Francisco. This was more than just a bridge, it was a symbol of human ambition and a modern engineering marvel. Despite the challenges, the construction of the Golden Gate Bridge was an incredible accomplishment for its time. Since its grand opening in 1937, the Golden Gate Bridge has become more than just a means of transportation. This iconic structure, stretching across the Golden Gate Strait, was the longest and tallest suspension bridge of its time. A feat of engineering that captured the world's attention, it was a testament to human ingenuity and determination. The Golden Gate Bridge wasn't merely a record breaker in terms of its size, it was, and continues to be, a symbol of innovation and progress. Its unique design, a collaboration between different experts, was a pioneering example of suspension bridge technology. The bridge's towers, designed by Irving Morrow, and the overall structural design developed by Leon Moiseif, brought together aesthetics and function in a way that was ahead of its time. Over the years, the Golden Gate Bridge has been carefully maintained and improved. A series of retrofits and enhancements have ensured its longevity, allowing it to withstand the test of time and continue to serve as a vital transportation route. These improvements, while often invisible to the casual observer, are crucial to the bridge's enduring strength and stability. The recognition of the Golden Gate Bridge as a wonder of the modern world is a testament to its significance. It stands as a symbol of the power of human creativity and the relentless pursuit of progress. It's a reminder of what we can achieve when we dare to dream big and work tirelessly to make those dreams a reality. Today, the Golden Gate Bridge stands not only as a symbol of California, but also as a modern marvel of engineering.